Well, good morning, everybody. And, uh, whew, see my breath. Happy Valentine's Day, February 14th. Let me show you a little something. See this dirty water in the trees? The train, uh, about 11, 12 straight days. I'm on North Lake here in East Tennessee, and, uh, it's literally came up 20 feet in that amount of time. 20 feet. That's crazy. Um, I don't know where the fish are. We're gonna try to find them. I got a little tournament tomorrow. Then next week kicks off the Tennessee Team Trail here on Norris, which is gonna be awesome. Then after that, of course, we're going to Cherokee the following week for the Morristown Marine. But a couple different things today. First off, I got my Valentine's with me. Cash, just kidding. That's my Valentine's getting her hair done. So we're uh, killing a few minutes more and try to find some fish. Uh, second of all, got a new camera. Filming on my new GoPro 8. I'm hoping big things from it. Uh, as soon as the mics get off back order or whatever, I'll be putting a new mic on here so you guys can actually hear me for once in a video. But uh, I don't know, guys. If I can catch one fish, I'll be I'll be pretty happy guy because I've not been out in a little over a week and this water coming up like this is blowing my mind. So with that said, let's get out here and uh, try to find something. All right, see you in a few. All right, guys, this is not one of my normal spots I would just stop and fish but uh it's 28 degrees and uh it's cold i got tired of running we gotta find some clearer water though for sure if we don't break all my rods in the boat it's gonna be windy i'm sorry what do you think cash cash is probably going to find somewhere warm That's a good one. That's actually a really good one. <sighs> oh. Just not going to give up, are you? Well, that was a probably the worst way you could ever catch a fish, but uh, look at there, guys. Man, look at that stripe, how pretty. Good fish. Let's back off the bank. Pull out, look at there. Think I didn't want that? Right where you want it to. Golly, pretty fish, pretty fish. There's one. That was like a pretty good one. That's a big old small mouth. Big small mouth. Just dogging me. No nets. We're just going to try to flip it. Oh, yeah. Big fish. Big fish. Look at there. Woo! Big small mouth. That's a nice one. Look there, Cash. Oh, yeah. That's a 19 incher. Pretty fish. What's up, guys? I apologize for uh, not doing a closeout on the water. I mentioned in the video I just got this new uh, GoPro 8 and I'm really happy with, but I've just not learned all the same that my first trip out with it. And somehow throughout the morning, I got it set on uh, time warp or warp. Either way, it's super fast speed. Lost a little bit of footage. Uh, you didn't miss a whole lot more. Uh, there was only two more fish after the two fish you've seen. Uh, three of them came on. They were all largemouth, came on, which is odd, but they all came off the Ned rig. 
And again, I throw that just slightly, a little bit bigger vehicles going by. 3 16ths out head, 3 16ths ounce head. And I throw one with a weed guard, especially right now with all this trash in the water. And that's the big TRD, green pumpkin. Of course, I throw it on braid with a seven pound Sunline Sniper leader. If you're not watching my Ned Rig video, go watch it because I'll go over my whole setup, but I'm a firm believer in this sniper line. Of course, my Dixie Custom 7'5 Super Extreme Finesse Rod. Love this rod for a Ned Rig. It just really lets them load up. You lose less fish, I feel like. Of course, the big smallmouth came off this. That's a, that's a 3.8 Kitek. I believe that's pearl color. Um, and I, I put it on a quarter ounce Big Bites Baits head. And I actually just had that on uh, eight pound test fluoro. Um, and this is on one of uh, Dixie's new rods. This is the uh, the new feather stick. Uh, this is a six foot eight medium fast tip. Awesome, awesome rod. I can't speak. I'll probably do a whole series about these new rods he's got out. But uh, man, awesome rod. Super sensitive. Got enough back. Got a good tip. Good enough backbone though to fight those big fish in. But uh, again, apologize for kind of a short video. But uh, it was a fun day given the conditions. Uh, it's just it's been a little tough for me lately. Uh, some of the other guys are, they figured out this high, dirty water. So I'm going to have to get out there also because next Saturday, Tennessee Team Trail here on Norris. Saturday after that, Morristown Marine Trail on Cherokee. I'll be making some videos for both, hopefully practice videos and tournament videos, definitely for the Morristown. But uh, hey, we'll see. Wish me luck. Please like and subscribe. If you know somebody that might like this, tell them to subscribe. Helps me out a ton. But uh, hey, see you guys on the water.